Sauce on the internet, Legend of Winning says, Cheryl Swoops is willing to tear down everyone in WNBA history, including herself, before admitting she was wrong about Caitlin Clark. This is in reference to Cheryl Swoops appeared on Gilbert Arenas' podcast and the conversation was about dominating. And Cheryl said, and I quote, to me, what Caitlin has been able to do in a short period of time has been very impressive. I still don't think she's dominating, but she's a different player than she was in the first half of the season. She added that she never questioned if Caitlin was a good player, but she suggested that neither Caitlin nor Angel Reese would immediately put up the kind of numbers they did in college in the WNBA. All right. Now to that, that's why this guy above said this comment. Somebody below said, and I'll say it again. No one had a clue who Cheryl Swoops was before Caitlin Clark came along. It's not even to be debated. Because of Caitlin Clark, we now know who Cheryl Swoops is. Funny, isn't it? That is patently untrue. Here's one of the things I hate about the internet. It's okay to say the truth. You can say, I didn't know about Cheryl Swoops until Caitlin Clark, because that's the truth for you. But nobody knew about Cheryl Denise Swoops before Caitlin Clark. That's just not true. I remember when the WNBA first started, it was a humongous deal. Cheryl Swoops was the first person drafted to the WNBA, three-time MVP, won championships in the WNBA, FIBA, and college. A lot of people know who Cheryl Swoops is. Even if you never saw a WNBA game or them play in the Olympics, you could have seen this episode of Martin where Cheryl Swoops is number seven behind Rebecca Lobo. She's with Don Staley and Teresa Edwards. You could have just watched Martin and you could know who Cheryl Swoops is. Here's what I want people to understand. You can disagree with people without making up untrue things. You could say, you know what, Cheryl Swoops? I disagree with that statement. But that don't mean people don't know Cheryl. And here's the other thing. I think these statements are such a big deal because Cheryl Swoops is who she is in the WNBA, in the Hall of Fame. I think if she was a player who didn't have her accolades, this might not be as big of news as it is. But just to say nobody, not to be debated, and this low-key is one of the big complaints about non-Caitlin Clark stands. It's like y'all can say Caitlyn's good. That can be true. That girl's going to be rookie of the year, probably unanimous. She might make all WNBA first team, probably for sure going to get second team. That can all be true. She could have proven some of the people wrong. But that, but then to say that the, the, the argument that people didn't know who was in the WNBA, what was going on, it was nothing before her. That's what a lot of people push back on. And all you had to say is, I ain't know who Cheryl Swoops was, and I disagree. And you'll be fine. That ain't what people do, is it?